I really had an interesting question underneath one of my videos in the comments the other day about how can you change the time it takes for dead players to despawn on your server to, you know, to either quicken it up or, um, or make them last longer. And so in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it. It's handled by globals.xml, and this is true for PC, PlayStation, and Xbox. In fact, what I'll do is in the description below this video, I'll link to the official Bohemia Interactive uh, wiki and their central economy configuration article which goes into all of the different settings so we'll look at dead animal dead infected dead player um and it's a very powerful file this one you can change things like um uh you can disable zombies on this you can disable food decay you can change the spawn time um uh, when you join a server and when you leave a server as well L lots of other stuff like that but anyway in this one we're going to be looking at uh, dead player cleanup so what you want to do is zoom on over to your server provider in this case it's nitrado for me click on the web interface that'll take you to the dashboard and then what we want to do is go to the file browser and then we want to go to the missions folder so xb missions for xbox ps missions for playstation just missions on pc and then depending on whether it's a Chernus uh, server or a Livonia, Livonia will say Enoch, or the new uh, Frostline map, which I, it's, I keep forgetting what it's called, that will be there. But this is a Chernus server, so we're going to click on that. And then we're going to click on the DB directory, or the DB folder. We're going to go, go into that one. And then we want to edit the globals.xml. Now, normally I don't recommend editing on your um, server browser. Uh, on your server browser, on your PC browser, but this is a fairly simple thing. So let's have a look. So here we are. So that's the one we're after. Variable name equals cleanup lifetime dead player, the one underneath it, which currently is 3,600 seconds, which is one hour. So um, you may want to, let's say you wanted to half that to 30 minutes. We could then go to, uh, that would be 1,800 seconds like that so that's now half the time or you could make it quite far so you could do it I don't know say 600 seconds so that would be 10 minutes um, and I guess this is really if you've got like a maybe a deathmatch ser server or a free-for-all server where people are dying all the time and you, <laughs> you don't want the map to be cluttered with dead bodies that have got lots of loot on them as well um, for server performance and also for the, the gameplay experience and as you can see um, you've got uh, dead infected they despawn after 330 seconds which 330 seconds which will be uh, about five minutes and then animals hang around for 1200 seconds which is my mental arithmetic is a bit crap 1200 divided by 60 seconds is 20 minutes so they hang around for that long um, so yeah, so change these to whatever you you know whatever you want to. Maybe not too short. You don't want maybe dead players or dead infected dead animals disappearing in front of someone. Um, now, what I'm not quite sure about is if a dead player or a dead infected or a dead animal gets um, uh, what's the word I want to use uh, interfered with. That's probably not the word I'm looking for, but <laughs> interacted with. I'm not sure if these values then extend. Um, and of course, I, these won't disappear when somebody's looking at them either. So that's when that would be extended that way. Also remember, if one of your things is to do with, you want, mainly to do with the, you want the dead bodies not to, to be there. Um, the other thing you can do obviously is with dead players, and I think dead infected as well. I'm not sure if you can do this with dead animals is you can bury them, can't you? So you can go up with a spade and you can bury them so they disappear that way. Hmm. Anyway, so there we go. That, my friends, is how you either shorten or lengthen the, li the lifetime that dead player bodies will hang around on your server and infected zombies and animals. So if you found this video useful, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And of course, I'll see you again. Oh, sorry. And then what you do when you're finished, click save and restart the server. <laughs> there we go. See you again soon.